Okay, genius. Where are we going to look first for Demet? I'm not looking for Demet. I'm scouting Sorry, for she shots. She said the meth, and I was way, like, great. I don't remember this part. She How said Dumet. I can care deaf. about more than one thing at a time. Wow. You know, breaking this job has made me really understand what a sociopath is. Well, we our show way, is going educational. Downstairs? Dark. Yeah, okay, I wanna see this. Did this go up one? Okay, this is deaths, this is deaths in the fucking thing. It is deaths. It's deaths in the thing. It has to be. Or, or dolls made. Oh shit, what this place looks here? like fuck. I, no idea. Ooh, I wonder if we're gonna go back in time as like someone. Um, this looks like a script. Yeah, it looks Aaron, like. Aaron, can you hear like, me? Uh, you warn me before you start shouting. Yeah, Jesus. Oh, I wonder if we're gonna go back and play as Kate and trash this room running through here. I'm starting they to call the We've setting. Yeah, but she's been gone a long time now. Erin! Hey, oh, no, can she you shut the fuck outside. up? I'm trying to... She has asthma. She's not smoking. You know what I mean. We'll find her. Can you guys shut the fuck up so I can read? I read very slow because I have dyslexia. Hi, Rogue. What's up, Waffles? Hell yeah. Uh, You might have to refresh the page if you want to announce it. Wait, what? Wait, can you... Shh. Shh. The hell? Shh. Ma'am, I'm trying to read, please. Okay. I want to make commentary. Shh. Why are they talking while I'm trying to fucking read this? I just want to say, they call this place the murder castle in their settings thing. Okay. Um. With red blood and its sheets were washed in mother's tears. This sound right to you to camera? Transpose some imagery over these lines. FX of screams of sobbing. Oh, there's something about Dumet here. Does our audience understand cog, cog signing? Does our crew understand croc? Oh my god, that's funny. Where is... In a recreation of the infamous building where noted entrepreneur and H.H. Holmes expert Grantham Dumet has. Take this extraordinary opportunity to... Screams. I think Erin can do this. Not sure I want on my legal case if she has an asthma attack. Interesting. It's definitely Kate, so I wonder if we're gonna go back and have to play as Kate running through here. Um, wait, there's a dark picture. I see it. Give me the give me the juice. Give me the juice. Okay, avoid the chains? I don't know, fuck. These, these park, dark pictures are making it seem like this white glove guy is a really bad dude and that we should attack him. And that's what I tried to do. That's what I tried to do last game or last time we played and I got someone killed. And so it obviously wasn't the right choice. Hey, I found What's... Dumet's business card. Interesting, it's blank. On a camera. Okay. Jamie, over here. Oh, wait, this looks like the exact floor that he just okay. got. Yeah, I'm freaking the fuck out. It's just blood. Just blood? Yeah, just blood. blood. What do you We're mean? Conclusions. Or maybe this is from Aaron. Stop it. You always assume the worst. All we know is something was dragged along this way and it was bleeding. And that's not a cause for concern to you? All right, it's a little odd. Odd. What do you want me to say? 
Just blood, Look, I know. Like, how could you just say... The are dragging in some dead animal from outside. Maybe it's our dinner. Ew. Either way... Like, don't people skin Welcome shit? Welcome one and all to tonight's entertainment. Oh, what the fuck? Presented no. by Grantham Dumet. Dumet? Well, so he hasn't left. This is psycho. What is going on? Oh, is this gonna be like a saw trap? Gonna be like a saw trap, dude. I can feel it in my jimmies, in my bones. Did we go towards the music? Does it matter? Just don't get a chain in my chest. That's the goal. close you're really far back that is not close I'm gonna get trapped in here oh god this is where that couple was hiding yeah Ugh. Ugh, no there's someone like panting and dying I hear someone dying. I hear someone dying. Please come over here, Jamie. I'm very scared. Can you not hear that, girl? Oh, this is shiny. I saw it early. Uh, I don't like that. I don't want to go through the door. I don't want to face choices. Oh, no. Help. You hear that? Please. Help. The fuck? Help me. It's a hazmat Please. guy. Please. Are you? Don't do anything. What happened? Are you okay? I don't get a chance. What the fuck? Stop. Look. Oh my god, it is like a saw trap. What am I supposed to do? This is a fucking booby trap. You shift your weight off that plate and this guy is getting run through by that thing. and it didn't work out. I'm gonna stay this time. Trapped. What do we do? Break the fucking door down. Right. On three. How? One, there's wa there's two, like barbed wire. Uh, uh, uh. Or like not bar there's bars. Wait, so the guy couldn't be saved? He would have yes. died either way? What is that? Yeah, I guess because I would have stepped off no matter what. So I wonder what the consequences are if I stayed and just got my nose like. 
I'm realizing, though. Wait, why am I? Find your spirit crystal. Don't do that. Oh, was she, I thought she was patching Don't up make fun blood. Of me. I was like, did we Sorry. miss something? I don't want you to cut yourself. The rock is sharp as hell and, you know, super magical. It's an amethyst crystal. It helps keep you calm by blanketing you in protective energy. I know. I remember. If you know, then don't call it a rock. Maybe I just feel like you should take responsibility of your own emotions and stop outsourcing the job to a crystal. Just tell him it makes you feel better. Like, that's how I feel about, like, feel the crystal better. shit. Like... Something you never seem to be able to do. Okay, maybe that was a shitty thing to say. Yeah. I'm sorry. It's fine. This isn't the time or place to... I have to tell you something. Okay. Earlier, you brought up that DP job I blew off. I never told you the truth about it. About what? It wasn't a job, not really. What are you talking about? Remember my friend Murray? He was setting up a studio in Brooklyn, Fine Arts. He wanted a partner. <laughs> That's your dream. Yeah. There is exactly zero money to made, so I thought you'd tell me it was insane, rightfully. Because it would be. Man, I need that plan. <laughs> if that's how the maniac was, I don't know. I think, like, though, the maniac guy... Why the hell didn't you go oh, for I it? I don't want to talk over them. Why didn't you tell me? Things were already starting to get tough for us. Oh, no, no, no. Don't put any of this on me. This is all you. I know. I turned it down because it would have taken me away from you. Um. I, I guess I didn't even think of that. Oh, we're up in the romance. Does this matter? Let me move along. I, People are dying. I just. Look at that Kim Kardashian clip where it's what like. What did say? Dude, Guess Matt I was and, for things to change with and this. Jamie, I forget their Get fucking down. names. Kate and I'm still hoping. Chris, I forget his name. There's people that are dying. <laughs> can we can we wait? These people drive me insane. You should have said all this before. I know. It's like, yeah, I'm not this is great. To it all again. What if this time is different? Oh, come on. That's not likely, and you know it. Sorry. I guess I'm a little confused. We better go. Let's find Aaron and get the fuck out of here. Ready to leave and find Do you think Aaron. they found you, man? I don't care. I'm more interested in finding Aaron, which I'm sure Charles is not concerned with. Why do you call him that? What? Charles? Because he hates it, obviously. God, this place is like a maze. Wait. Campus Strangler strikes again. Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Oh, Did that's her. This? No. Is it her? Yeah. Shelby. Matching nails? God, don't. We always got them done the same. Her friend died or something by a campus that's strangler. Him. What? And the that's man. Him. The guy in the back. You know him? Kinda did. He was just one of those guys that was always around. We'll be at some of the same parties, but that's it. It was my fault. You know that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I slept through. It was a big deal on campus not to go out on your own. Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and. That's when, they, that's when he got her. It's okay. No, it's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day, and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. What the hell is that? 
I have no idea. But I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now! Charlie! No, 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 what are you doing? You can't hold the wall open. You cannot hold the wall open. You cannot hold the wall open. I can't hold this. You have to get the fuck out any way you can. Just get the fuck out, now! What the hell just happened? I, I don't know, but I think it's really, really bad. Okay, I have chills. It's moving. So now what? We're fucked. That has to be the way, right? Yeah, maintenance corridors, crawl space, has to be. Let's go, let's find it. Oh, just be careful. This place is fucking booby-trapped. He knows that we all know now. Oh, he's gonna try to trap him in here. Uh, What's going on? Demet, what the hell is going on with him? He was nervous the whole way here. I chalked it up to him just being eccentric. There's a lot of miles between eccentric and murderous. It's not him, it's someone else that's like doing Let's all the murder. You saw Dumet take off. So maybe he found out there was a killer and bugged out? Maybe. Or perhaps the man we met wasn't actually Dumet. And the dude in the mask is? Yep. Precisely. That contraption, that's a hell of a lot to set up. That was planned out, every bit of it. It was set up for us to find. Which makes it even more likely the dude on the ferry wasn't really the Met. Yeah. I hear the walls moving, dude. I hear them moving. Oh, don't, don't, don't touch anything. Don't fucking touch anything, dude. Any weird thing on the ground, just don't fucking touch it. Don't even, don't even look at it. Motherfucker. What? Brick wall. Keep going. Just like Holmes. I know. I don't want to think about it. Wait, what do you mean just like Holmes? I wish I knew more about this guy. I wish we saw more of your documentary. Hi, Malakia. Malak Malakia. like this trying to map this in my head but I think Erin's room has been completely cut off Jesus Charlie why is he messing with her because she's, dead, she's the bro. most easily frightened the most vulnerable don't you watch our show that's what these sociopaths do Daddy. oh what the fuck is that a kid? Uh, oh good you hear a creepy kid voice too I was worried I was finally snapping. You hear a creepy What's kid voice from? too. A coin! We still haven't been able to buy anything with these from like the guy. But good to have them, I guess. Of uh, nervance, I don't know. Charlie, come here. He's already here. Let's get this open. <clears throat> God, I wouldn't touch shit. <gasps> it's the cold rooms, like that screenshot. I. It's the exact. Okay, so something's gonna happen to them. I think. These are the exact rooms I saw in that screenshot. Also, these are probably where that hook is, so we gotta be careful. <laughs> of, um, the old guy. We're in a bloody nesting doll. What? A Russian nesting doll. You know? A doll in a doll in a doll. Are you losing your shit? Because I don't need that right now. We're locked in a kitchen, trapped in a hotel, 
stranded on an island. Even if we get out of this room... How do we get out of the hotel? Exactly. Or off the island. Maybe we just focus... <laughs> Natalie Morello. Oh, are you... Body. You think? Meet the last party that visited this hotel. You don't know that. Maybe it's... Fuck. Fuck. You're probably right. Even I wanted to be a little hopeful that we're not about to get fucking clapped right now. But I think we're gonna get Charlie, clapped right on now. The way out, maybe. Look, this one swings out. We can probably force it easier than the others. Stand back. That's... Not what I was expecting. Ah, Jamie! Ah! Ah! Fuck. Charlie? Fuck. Dude, that's what I that's why I was looking at the floor, guys. You were laughing at me. Jamie? It's Hello? Booby trap. Aaron? Keep it down. Where could she be? She can't have just vanished. Mark. Come over here. What is going on? Are, are we locked in here? Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Shh. What? Shh. Yeah, that's it. You hear that? Is that them? Where's it coming no, from? No, it's a recording. Somebody's in the restaurant. Hi, Team Moy. What's the plan, Charlie? You end up dead. I'd like to toast. Oh, we don't even get to choose. I know that I'm the butt of your jokes, and that's just my cross to bear as the patriarch of our little family. Mark and Jamie, the two of you do the work of a team of ten. And Kate, despite our bickering, you are the heart of this show. You keep the people fuck. interested. What the fuck is this? Why the dolls? Why the dolls? Mark, what are you doing? Just stay back from it. This is beyond messed up. I don't know what Charlie's gotten us into, but if I see Dumet, I'm gonna fuck him up. Okay. I know, I don't wanna- Has I don't- seen Mr. Dumet? There has to be a legit reason he left. You hear that? Footsteps. And they're getting closer. We gotta hide. Watch out. Ah, oh, shit. There's an ashtray next to us. Don't attack. Don't attack be anyone. No, it, it's... No, I don't want to. Ugh. I'm a Jamie. genius. I'm a genius. Thank God. I'm so glad to see you guys. They made the we footsteps the intentionally sound heavy as fuck, too. Oh my God. When that wall shut, I... I'm just glad you're okay. Demet killed his groundskeeper. What? Right in front of us. Demet? It's a I'm setup. I he hate was wearing this. a mask, and I know how that sounds, but I'm not joking, and now he's after Aaron, so we need to move. Wait, hang on. Where's Charlie? I don't know. We got separated. No way this is happening. You know, so when our bodies wash up on the other side Are of you the fucking lake, kidding me? Bodies. Jesus, Dead. shut Bodies. it up! Dead. 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 Who's that? This... It's fake. A prop, or from an animal or something. It has Aaron's to be. Aaron's eye? No, 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 no way. Don't pick it up! Don't pick it up! 
pick it up! No! Oh! Oh, it's real! It's fucking real! I told you! This was all too much! Let's get out of here. Oh, it's locked! What's going on? The door I came through is locked, too. I'm so stressed. I'm so stressed. You mad? You wanna play around? Get out here. Right now. Let's fucking play! Okay, Charlie's in the basement. Uh. He looked handcuffed for a second, but I can't tell. Or no, he's good. Poor Charlie, man. It's a hard fall. Yeah, we're locked in some sort of room. I think Aaron would have been here with us. If she didn't kick the can. Jamie! Yeah, no shot you're getting Hello? back up there. Jamie! Hi, Jake. It's been great. I'm okay! I'm still... I'm mad. I'm so mad about the Aaron thing, dude. Oh, shit. Did I just catch on fire? I don't like that. Cage key? Okay. Well, we got the cage key now. I don't know how I feel about the flame thing. I think we're- remember- remember we got trapped in a room in one of the visions and we were on fire. That's in here. Has to be. I don't see anything else to do other than use the key, so... Definitely like, yeah, look, look at the fucking wiring. Yeah, there's a lot of flammables in here. What the fuck? Chicago killer, victim one, cause of death, abdominal injuries. Victim's ear was removed by a severely sharp object, possibly a scalpel. number two. I'm assuming you've read my report on the first one. Similar MO, unidentified male with multiple stab wounds. Looking at the lower abdomen, the wounds are consistent with those of the first victim. The shape of the entry wound suggests it's a strong probability that this is the same murder weapon. Looks like we've got a souvenir hunter here. This time the left ear has been severed. Clean incision. Probably a scalpel or a razor blade. Very tidy. Nice job, actually. Very little bleeding. The deceased had probably been dead for 30 to 40 minutes when this was done. This differs from the earlier MO. If you remember, that John Doe was still alive when the teeth were removed. That would have created a lot of noise and mess. This guy is learning. I hate this, I hate this. Some computer logbook thing. This is about the old family when they came in. Most of the crew have arrived on the island, moved all the equipment up to the hotel, met with the hotel pro prop Sure, Mr. Belknap. On-site assignment has begun. Excavation has begun in the hotel basement. Work on the first and second floor is going to be as expected. 
Some equipment has gone missing, filed a report, and requested replacements via Mr. Belknap per our contact contract. James Kelly has left the project, left a note citing an emergency, didn't contact me directly, written report to follow. First set of moving walls have been implemented, acquired a copy of blueprints for Mr. Belknap. Started working on the basement ceiling supports. Tomorrow, legible. Legible, legible. Bobby has left me high and dry here. Second loyal guy to leave me on this project. Bar renovation began. Uh, plumbing has been completed. Second floor renovations need to be completed next week. Bar renovation complete. Project efficiency is good. If this continues, we'll meet the agreed date. Reconstructed walls. All moving walls completed. <coughs> Signal receiver is installed. More reports of missing equipment. Third replacement request filed this month. Project completed at agreed date. Proprietor, prop, proprietor is requesting additional work on the spa area beneath the hotel. Only a small skeleton crew are still on the island, so we will conduct an initial cost assessment while waiting to hear back from Kelly. Received correspondence from Kelly, skeleton crew remaining, Laura, Monica, Ryan, Frank, and I will move forward with the work on the spa until the crew returns. Ryan has left me a note saying his mom isn't well. I'm sure she died years ago. We will see if Mr. Belknap note will allow me to contact him. Interesting. Hmm. What? It's like a peephole. You're not concerned about that? Thought I saw something watching us. God, the camera right now. I'm looking for like pl pressure plates and shit. Locked, okay. Don't want to play the trap game. I don't. <gasps> oh, I guess I'm wrong. I'm not. I'm not an electrician. <laughs> get past the locked gates I don't feel comfortable just flipping the switches willy-nilly this is definitely what the fire room looked like <laughs> Why do I need to look in here? That's concerning. Hi, Waffles. Have a great day. We're gonna die in here, dude. We're gonna die. to do without being like hyper 
like hyper looking around for shit. I can smell the Dead by Daylight map being made right now from this game. My key card, yeah? Or my business cards. Really? Art, thank you so much for the Reese uh, for seven months in a row. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. God, I just... This is not safe or a good idea. What's the point of doing this? Fire! No, 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 no. There's gotta be a way. Come on, you don't see the fire... start a fire in here like we're gonna be trapped <coughs> I'm just gonna be mad at the game if he dies right here because I pulled the switch because I was hyper aware I was looking at the fucking wiring for these goddamn doors okay the game didn't give me enough options there's nothing else to do going on. Wait, they're screaming. I thought it was going to burst into flames in here. Oh my god, just run out. Fuck this shit. No, we're not going in there. Right, we're not going in there. Right, we're not going in there. We're gonna die in here. He got cooked! He got cooked! No. No, we literally cannot. We're gonna die in there! Lighter fluid, dude. No, no, they're gonna make me pick it up. Are you serious? Well, hello, gorgeous. Praise the Lord. They're it's making real. me don't light it, please. This is gonna be the best cigarette of your life. No, I can't flip switches twice. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna just assume I had to do that. I know there was no choice to be made. If he dies in that room right now, like. Probably gonna head to the spa if that little note thing had any. Or no, I think we're. Praise the Lord. What's he doing? Dude, 
Watch where you're stepping. We gotta get out. How? Hey! Hey, hello! I'm here! Hello. No way. way to go. I have to wonder how the group will fare without their leader. Mark and Kate clearly want to be truthful with each other, but it turns out that Kate has been hiding something from Mark, maybe even trying to hide it from herself. And how do we feel about Mr. Dumet's lovely animatronics? I think they're rather clever. Some of them look very realistic. I wonder where he sources the parts. It would only be fair at this stage to offer up a little hint to even the odds. Yeah. What do you think? Give me a hint. Let's take some inspiration from the works of Sir Arthur Conan Doyle. Apparently, our friend Herman Mudgett was so enamored with Sherlock Holmes that he borrowed his surname. Hmm. Here. <clears throat> he has a brain of the first order. He sits motionless like a spider in the center of its web. But that web has a thousand radiations, and he knows well every quiver of each of them. I hope that helps. I have coins. Do you not want them? You'd better get back to things. Best of luck. I seriously feel like I'm being set up. Like the other games feel like, you know, there's like several opportunities to like fuck up. Also, 
I would have tried the door again, but here's the thing. We saw a vision of him dying with the, the little slidey thing open. Meaning that he would have died I, even if I got that slidey thing open. I could have saved him. Yeah, you could have. Why were you guys just standing there? It's Aaron. No way. Damn it. It's another trap. It's the only way out of here. So this place is trapped. Going to find out. This is skit. This is how you do it today. Is this a good idea? I don't see any other options. hint he gave us is that the place the is fucking trapped we? but we knew that like we literally knew that it was trapped as hell in here I can't save anyone. I can't save anyone. Jesus. Chill, y'all. Let's go. We got places to be. through this thing. Okay, do it. Three, two, one, go! <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Another worker. He killed all the workers that tried to quit. Oh my god, he killed all the workers that tried to quit. I 
remember the note. Jesse, I quit with immediate effect. By the time you read this, I will have already left the island. Don't come looking for me. I quit. I'm done. Why, why they try to quit? Because the dude's psychotic. And they're, he's making them do like these insane projects on this building. I mean I just saw him what does that mean we're fucked dude I don't think we're gonna get I mean now we're not even gonna get a good ending but like we're fucking doomed I don't think I'm going to be able to save anyone. I really feel like the game is like working against me right now. Dude. It's all of the crew, dude. Frank, how the man. What's the point of getting each of their ID cards? Just knowing that they were all killed? I kind of, I deduced that they might have been killed for trying to quit. worth a lot too bad the fucking dude back at home base doesn't give me anything for them oh we're supposed to look at oh i'm a dumbass oh i didn't know yeah this is safe stressed stay close obviously jesus Fuck. What the fuck just happened? Alright, don't go near that, I guess. As I walk towards it. Dude. I just want to say, too, if I was in this situation, I would, I would do a lot more different things. Like, I just feel like the game, as far as giving me options, is not really giving me options. I guess we're jumping down. I don't really want to. It seems like a trap. It seems like we're gonna get drowned or something. This fucking place is gonna fill up with water. Oh, it, yeah, okay, so it's hype, but instead of the E, it's a U. There must be something useful around here. I doubt that. Maybe a rock and you can beat the shit out of the dude. <laughs> Gotta be a way through. Dark as shit, bro. I can't see anything. Can I get up there? Or is that the way we came from? 
Keep looking around. I am. You're not helping. Not this shit again. Okay, I'm pretty good at the balancing one. Was I supposed to jump down there? I guess. Now we're like on the other side of those walls. Oh God. I guess we'd pop back up. We're just standing around. Stop! I st they're so mean to me, bitch. I can't see. If you if you got an idea, then you fucking tell me. I can't see. I have to look around. There's definitely a trapped ass room up ahead. So if my my friend here could hurry the fuck up. That'd be great. Mark, give me a hand moving this shit. Oh, there's not that many quick times. Oh, that door's heavy! <laughs> we are like in a nesting doll, dude. We are trapped. We are trapped. Huh. That's where that hanging guy was. Yep, this looks safe. Let's just crawl on through. Fucking work. What are we supposed to do? I don't want to push it, but I will. They're just small. I don't want to be near this, dude. I feel like that was a trap from Saw. De it definitely was. It was a little different in Saw, but same idea. Uh, like two people try to pull back and forth. I was thinking, though, like, the way they had it up, set up in Saw, Saw's like one of my favorite series, so like I think about it a lot. But the way they had it set up in Saw, it wasn't really like fightable. But this one, I feel like, I mean, in the moment, everyone's gonna be like selfish and stuff. But I feel like the person could have just bent down and got their chain cut. Like they didn't have to pull each other right into the thing. That's kind of how the, um, oh, his ID card. Ryan. The way they had 
it set up in Saw, though, they could not really, like, get the chains cut or anything like that. But it kind of reminds me of Saw 6, which is a Saw movie I really like. I'm not going to spoil it for you, but it just reminds me of that. The blow. Yeah, pay your egg taxes, people. I know we're in a recession, but, you know... Someone's got to pay the metaphor metaphorical bills here. Keep the stream going. Where are we now? What's up, Justin? Another coin thing that are fucking useless. Justin, I got the old man killed. I'm sorry. Okay, it's making scary noises and shit. Every time I pick one of those up. Kind of making me think I shouldn't be picking those up. But that's just me. Maybe I'm wrong. Well, Kate's gone. She dipped. This is the only way to go? Oh. Excuse me, sir. We're going back this way. Yeah, just uh, go on through. I guess we're jumping down from here. No, we are not. What are we doing? Oh, Mark, here we go. Here. Let's move the desk. <laughs> Mark? Jamie? Here. Kate. We're okay. Hey, we're alive. We're okay. <gasps> Thank God. There we wasn't a really key. a way for us to Let's die there. Um. <laughs> Hear that? This way. But why go towards the music? I know I've been doing that all game, but it's definitely deaths. Because all the dolls are made when the old man died. It's definitely deaths <laughs> in the building. That's not Aaron. Girl, just leave. Just leave. I've had enough of this shit. What the hell is going on? Well, Dumet offered a unique H.H. H. Holmes experience and Charlie couldn't resist. Problem yep. is, for Dumet, it's real. Moving walls, traps, tricks, it's everything. <laughs> shit. He knows where we are. Can you see him? Eat the living shit out of him, if possible. Guys, over here. Oh, this is where his grandma is or whatever? Holy shit. Is this? We don't know what it is. I'll watch the door. You guys look around. What the fuck is this? It looks like he was helping someone. I know it looks scary and bloody, but it, there's bandages and shit. Like, I think he was trying to help someone. Like, stay alive. Or harvesting their organs! Oh, I'm gonna throw up. 
That's where he gets all the money from. To like... Wait, I'm scared to open it. I don't want to open it. What else is in here? It seemed like trapped. I don't know why. This place got me on edge. I've seen Saw. Okay, fine, I'll open it. Because I feel like if I walk over there, it's going to do a cutscene. Also, you're supposed to grab the tab and then open it, but I guess she could just force force it open by the will of her Jesus. hand. Ooh. What is that? Okay, I don't want to look anymore. Ugh. What the fuck is that? All right. He's harvesting organs and selling them on the black market or whatever to get money for his murder castle. moving over there. Here! I Aaron? found it! No, that's the grandma. It's a mannequin. It's not Aaron. did he do to her? I'm so, so sorry. Don't fucking touch me. Don't start pretending like you give a shit now. Let's focus on getting the hell out of here. You two can fight later. God, that's so awful. We need a plan. Forget his games, traps, all that bullshit. Think about the killers we've covered. There's always a weakness. Are you suggesting we invite him to tea and psychoanalyze? I'm suggesting we use our heads. We can make guesses all day. But if we die here, it won't game. matter. I'm not playing detective, I just want to survive. Playing detective is how we survive. We play his games, we'll lose. We need to outthink him. He's trying to pick us off one at a time. We need to stick together. Hang on. You could be listening to us right now. Oh, no shit. Where got we cameras go? everywhere. Back to the ferry. It left, remember? It's on the line, maybe we could reel it in. Maybe it isn't good enough. The lighthouse. Maybe we can signal for help. There's police boats. Oh, they're gonna make me choose lakes, between right? lighthouse or ferry. Are here? Lighthouses are meant to be seen for miles. Are you shooting any of this? No one is gonna believe it without proof. You want me to record him trying to kill us? And the bodies? For the cops. Hear that? I fucking hate this game. I fucking hate it. I'm so stressed. Again. Kate, hang on. We need to stay close. Hey, you fucking dumbass. Shit. Kate! Hang on! Ah. Ah. Kate, you're a fucking idiot. I don't know what's going to be there, buddy. Mark! Jamie! Wait, no, no, no! Indeed. Oh, you are lucky that I didn't cut you in half, bitch. Is he dead? Oh, he made a dying noise. Hang on to that sucker. 
Oh, is that acid? Don't touch it. Hold on, don't fucking touch it. I swear to God, if he puts his hand in it. Gotta be like some sort of acid or something. This is what happens when you guys listen to one too many true crime podcasts. This is where you end up. I'm not gonna pick it up this time. Let's see if anything changes. It's probably silly of me to think that. It just seems like shit always hits the fan because I find those. And the guy, the old guy back at the story place, he doesn't give a fuck that I have them, so. So, wait. Oh, this is to take pictures? Paint thinner? Oh, should I take a picture of the acid? I don't know, I'm really bad at my job. I didn't know I was supposed to be taking pictures. I guess I haven't really played as Mark yet. Oh, there's shit over here. Probably use his, um, yeah, his little. You? Another lens? Or his old lens? The mount matches. Perfect. I don't know, man. That's weird. Probably the weirdest thing that's happened. The killer just happens to have... Oh god. Come back out. I think it's fine. What's this? I take a picture. I didn't know I was supposed to be getting fucking evidence. Zoom out. This is his workbench. That looks like an ordinary workbench. Move. I can't move. He doesn't see. 
see him under the table for real? God, the the banging and shit is really distracting. I think we are supposed to fall in here. I'm still holding Q just in case. I hate this so much. All right. We need to get pictures, boy. What? You don't think that's important? Seventy two, ninety three. Let me, let me, um, get a picture of this. Dang, in 4K. Caught in 4K. Um. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Zero, zero, two, eight. these things everywhere I feel like that has to be like his grandma or something that was like talking to him maybe All right, I think he went that way so we need to go this way wait that's fucking weird all those like I don't know I'm not a photographer whatever I'll take a picture of it anyway So many dolls. Look, there it is again. What is that? That has to be like something. Six eight three eight. Sixty eight eighty three. Eighty three. My bad. Dyslexic. Okay. I'm so weirded out by those tarp things. It's gonna scream at me or something. Real human teeth? Okay, wait. We need to take a picture of that. Don't put it back. We need to take a picture. You're so bad at your job. Worse than me. Whatever, dude. You suck at your job. I'm pressing Q, you fucking game. I'm pressing Q.
ring finger hurts. Oh, what is that? Is that our, like, leader guy? I once again cannot tell if it's safe or not. He wants to attach it to his thing. Oh, to make a weapon. Cool. There we go. I don't know what good that'll do, but... I mean, we already poked him with a similar tool before, and it did nothing. That is crazy looking. I don't want to touch it. I kinda do, but I don't. Press the button. What the fuck? Press the button. <gasps> press the button. Okay. Press it. Okay. Got okay. It. Press the button. Press it. Press the button. Press. No. It's gonna make like a loud noise. I'm once again not gonna pick up the coin. I don't know. I feel like they're bad luck. I'm done picking them up guy offered me nothing for picking them up so if that if that gives me the shittiest ending so I didn't pick them up whatever I don't know what the fuck's going on anymore FBI Hector Monday oh my god dude this man's crazy they didn't send more FBI people out here? I don't know what to put on those. What was, um... Let's just see what happens. What do we got to lose? Long time to let me pick again. Oh, it went green. It's recording. Give them to me. Give me my it recorded. Oh shit. Why? Like oh, this is a picture. Or no, it's not. Welcome new recruits. Oh, you think this guy works for the FBI? Or did? Maybe that's how he knows to cover it up so well. Psychological evaluation? Psychological assessment conducted by Dr. Isabella Garcia. Patient name, Monday, Hector. Behavioral observation. Hector arrived at our scheduled appointment 24 minutes late. Once we sat down and began the session, he struggled to maintain eye contact. He found it difficult to articulate his feelings and was terse and guarded throughout. Hector has been working long hours and, as a result, isn't sleeping well. Hector spoke about his recently deceased mother and displayed evidence that he hasn't yet fully come to terms with her death. I strongly recommended a course of antidepressants, but he is resistant to this idea, believing that it would have a detrimental effect on his capability with regards to his current investigation. Hector describes his work in immaculate detail 
And contrary to earlier in the session, his thought content is both coherent and logical. He is displaying an unhealthy obsession with his work. But his recent bereavement may be the underlying issue. That has to be the guy. Hi, Bun Bun. That has to be the guy, um... Like, the bad guy. He, like, used to work for the FBI. His mom died. We know there's an old lady involved here somewhere. I would close that back up. You don't know what this guy's capable of. This, this looks like a trap in itself. Well, I'm gonna assume he's safe. Now we gotta get Jamie safe. Shit. Yo! I'm not some fucking lab rat here for your amusement. I mean, that's exactly what he wants to happen, so. I don't know. Okay, well. So now what? This is where what's her face got killed. Not again. These fucking puzzles. For the last time, do not push the main switch until we get someone out here to replace the faulty wall. Okay. Wow, this is rough. It's a rough one. Can I start over? No, I cannot. Okay. Okay. I fucked up on this one. So it's this one, and this one, and this one. this one yeah then this one and this one then this one then this one Ooh. I got an achievement called shocking fix all of the fuse boxes baby Only 14%. There we go. Only 14%. Nancy Drew taught me well. Nancy Drew said, one day, girl, you're gonna have to fix these fucking fuse boxes and do the puzzle, and I'm gonna show you how right now in your youth. Let there be motherfucking light, retro. Now it feels like the game's working in my favor. It's always the first, like, one or two people in these games that are so easy to kill, and then the last three are, like, really hard to kill. This is, um, Aaron's room, yeah? It's, it's one of our rooms. Are you fucking kidding me? Her chapstick. Can we take it? It is Aaron's room. You don't want to keep it? I would have kept it. Oh, 
red room. Okay, whatever. I guess we're going in there. Aaron, Pepe, uh -huh. and they fucking mutilated her. Hector mutil- ah, I just scared myself on the mirror. Gone. I'm gonna get crushed somewhere. Wow. Kate is watching. Jesus, there's cameras everywhere. This is another area where I feel like we're not supposed to be in here. Oh, I can't go through there, right? Yeah, we have to go this way. <gasps> it's the guy from the trailer! be a killer you ever been to the art museum downtown they got this painting by a guy i forget his name famous painter he did portraits of slaughtered cows hanging on hooks uh, you take a normal person to a slaughterhouse and they will puke their guts out you make it into a painting and suddenly it's art there's no difference between the two not really. Don't look at me like that. You know I'm right. You get it. I know you get it. You got to do something that matters. Make people feel something they've never felt before. Shatter the illusion that any of us are really in control. Think of the most profound thing you've ever done. The most beautiful thing you've ever created. And I promise you, it's nothing compared to watching the life bleed out of someone. To see the fear in their eyes. To feel them pawing at you for release. To hear them pleading, begging. That moment when someone realizes they are at their end. That's when you Feel it. That's true art. That's what you have to be. An artist. A sculptor. An architect. I see the gleam in your eye, Agent Monday. You're not fooling me. Ah. Oh. Look at you now, huh? Am I gonna be your first? Well, come on then, huh? I'm right here. This room is soundproof. 
You don't even have to wait for a plane to fly overhead. Oh, this is the guy he was investigating. Interesting. Potential agent Monday. If you truly want to be an artist. I see what happened now. Oh god, I'm gonna have to hide, aren't I? So the killer guy that that guy we just saw. Come on! Oh wait, we're going back to Kate. <laughs> okay, so the guy who's like the killer, um, he was an FBI agent and he was working on a case with that guy who, um... We're using her mirror as a light? Okay. He's working on a case with that serial killer guy. And I guess he just, like, snapped. And he got the psychological evaluation probably because he beat up that guy when he was interviewing him. And he's probably really good at getting, not getting caught. Because he's very meticulous, you know, he was like in the FBI. Anxiety book. Who says self help books don't work? Right? rough. side of that mirror that um Jamie was checking out what's this another book Manny Sherman the best of the beast of Arkansas Joseph Morello so that wasn't you met on the ferry wait this is Morello We talked a lot. There was an ease at talking about anything. The night it happened, the cruel details, how they felt about him. It was just a fact of life to them. Their daughter had been murdered by a serial killer, and that was their world. The 
sounds really mean. Maybe use kinder words. I don't like the cocoon sentence. Is there really a relatable mem metaphor? Everything? I'm just skimming over this to see if I should read it. it looks like he's writing a book about a family he was like... Interviewing? Who got like... Their daughter got like killed by a serial killer or something. Her schoolwork was stacked by her bed, and her childhood toys and dolls were on display shelves. What stuck out the most was her uniform, still hanging in the front of the wardrobe, ready for her shift at the diner the next day. Mary was a tiny girl, only 5'1", and weighed less than 100 pounds. She didn't stand a chance that night she was taken. I kept thinking about her room as I drove throughout the town. Milton would have been an unremarkable place in 1995. But it was close to lifeless now, mostly boarded up buildings. The only open shops were liquor stores, which had bums outside of them drinking at 11 a.m. Scrambling over a package sat on our doorstep, a brown box. I had no idea who it was from. Had Michelle ordered something? Curiosity took over and I hauled it inside. Opening it, I found an old tape recorder along with a quartet of tapes. I listened to the voice, the first one. The voice was unremarkable, unmistakable. It was Sherman. Nope. Mentioned their interviews. Sherman was the strangler guy or like the, the killer. Is there only two pages to this? It looks like there's more writing on the next one. I guess not. I guess that's how he's involved. In case you missed me, Michelle uh, requested to use the library on the music lounges, so I assume one of those. Can we dine outside in the garden? The bar seems like a good writing spot. Doggy bowl? Connie. Connie? Beast's body burglid? Burgd? Burglid? The body of the so-called Beast of Arkansas has been removed from its grave by suspected body snatchers. The infamous serial killer, whose real name is Manny Sherman, was executed earlier this month and his remains were buried at an undisclosed cemetery in Springdale, AR. A senior police spokesperson for local law enforcement stated at a press conference, we believe it this to be the work of a serial killer obsessives and are pursuing various leads we assume there are multiple suspects involved but have not ruled out that it may be an individual although the burial site is unknown the rumors have been circulating among serial killer enthusi enthusiast forums online since sherman's execution when the when questioned by press about such online groups, the spokesperson added, These people who call themselves fans of serial killers are very foolish. If they were aware of the despicable details of such crimes, as we in law enforcement are, they would rethink their views about celebrating such heinous criminals. Police refused to confirm the name of the cemetery to the media in the aftermath of the news. Tribal! Thank you so much for 45 months, dude. Thank you, thank you. What it do, tribal? What it do? 
Please stop crying, mommy. Please stop crying, mommy. The fuck? Like the hazmat suit guy. A doll. Bethany. Bethany. Oh, go over. Oh my god. Crazy. The code might be this. Eight two five nine. I could try it. I was gonna guess nineteen ninety five. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Thank you for the bait. want to go in here the game's making me so also crying oh here we go <laughs> that doesn't tell me anything she's just gonna get dragged <laughs> thank you thank you Pope and skill kit for the thing <laughs> Thank you guys, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Yawning so hard now, I'm the one crying. Okay, she's getting dragged, but that didn't tell me anything, dude. It's just telling me what will happen. What's up, Jory? Hell yeah, dude. chill right ah! it's just Jamie I think it's me Get yeah here. psycho <sighs> thank God you could have said something like hey it's me Jamie don't be alarmed when what I smash this the fucking window place to see you too Kate Glad you're alive. Listen, I found out some new information. What? That guy on the ferry? That was not Dumet. That was Joseph Morello. He's a true crime writer. I found one of his books. How's he wrapped up in this? I don't know. Have you seen Mark? Not in person, but I spotted him on one of these monitors. Thank God. I was worried sick about him. Announce yourself, but I exactly. I also saw Dumet running around. That's not Dumet. You know it. It's like Hector or some shit. I forget his name already. How did he? This is like some Dead by Daylight shit with the fucking killer, like, being blind. the other side of the door I could see that but bro how did he not see them in the corner of his Jesus. eye what is all I did finish He's the bendy game feeds, I'm gonna be posting the second a mixer big enough parts on nice. YouTube soon but this everything. game came out and I was like He's got utilities running through here hydraulics electrics everything he can control the whole building from here how far down does it go this all connects this is how he's getting around the house 
investigate the control room. Okay, this is Charlie would say crazy. this guy is a fractured psyche. That he's wearing a mask to put what he's doing on a different personality. That's probably just his theory. It was Take a, look a at this. It's a fucking mannequin. It wasn't actually a groundskeeper. So it didn't what matter if I stepped back or not, right? The guy we saw murdered. It was a setup. There was no groundskeeper. We saw a guy in a yellow jacket with her stuff. I guess that was Mr. Demet. I think it's a mistake to say he's just crazy. He is in full control of what he's doing. He's just not wired like the rest of us. That's not crazy. He's been tracking us since we arrived. Mark was last seen in the basement 